Field of seven, Pacey Mares on the gate for the Friday night opener. Here they come. And there they go. They're off fan pacing. A Damer Sealster. A good start on the inside. Rub and Tug going with her on the outside. And the extreme outside. Odds on Riesling offers up early speed. Down on the rail is Catch a Dragon. They'll be the first four away. Trying to cross over to get a seat in fifth down on the pylons. That is McGannum again. Then it's back to the last two. Angelic Star in the early trailer is Precious Camille. Parked out is Rub and Tug and Jamison. And she is forced to drive on. Rub and Tug. Parked out to the quarter, but she's now touched down on the lead as she takes over that advantage from the heavy one to two post time favorite, a Damer Sealster. But it's going to cost her 26 seconds opening panel. And out from the pocket quickly, here comes Zeron right lining on the heavy favorite, a Damer Sealster. So as they cross three eights, a Damer Sealster has now taken advantage into the backstretch. But she's going to have company on the outside quickly rushing up. Here comes Angelic Star with a backstretch move. And right on her back is McGinnum again. That's Quickly going to put Rub and Tug down on the inside fourth. Back in fifth, that is Catch a Dragon. Now taking over a spot as Precious Camille is roughly gated and off stride as odds on Riesling, who now trails the field. 55 and four is the half mile speed. Advantage on the inside, still a Damer Sealster, but she's being pressured hard on the outside by Brewer and Angelic Star. Liking this action, second over right now is McGinnum again as she's working herself into a great trip. And from the pocket and needing room to get out down the stretch will be Rub and Tug sitting fifth and looking to get off the pylons. Now is Catch a Dragon and Precious Camille starting to offer up a little bit of late pace. Then it's back to Odds on Riesling, 124 to three quarters. And out to a length and a half lead is a Damer Sealster. She's fended off that challenge of Angelic Star, but now there will be an open spot here for Rub and Tug, who's going to re-rally on the outside. Rub and Tug, three wide tracks shown by McGannum again from the back catch. A dragon hits a Damer Sealster in between Rub and Tug. Furthest out, McGannum again. Maybe has the advantage. McGannum again on the outside. Had eight to one upsets over Rub and Tug and a Damer Sealster. Mile time, 152.